At the 51st plenary meeting, members of the Senate discussed the law on telecommunications in new edition. The law was approved by senators. Details in the following report. At the 51st plenary meeting, members of the Senate discussed the law on telecommunications in a new edition. The law was approved by senators. The current law on telecommunications was adopted in 1999. A number of provisions provided for in it are outdated and do not fully meet the requirements of today. In particular, since existing regulatory mechanisms and terms have lost their relevance, in practice there are cases of misinterpretation and obstacles to the development of the industry. Hence, the new version of the law on telecommunications provides a number of conveniences to the population and entities operating in the field of telecommunications. Thus, today some of the new apartment buildings that have been built have to be reconstructed, since the appropriate infrastructure is not provided. In order to prevent such hassles, from now on, a modern telecommunications infrastructure will be mandatory during the construction of buildings and structures. In particular, if there is an application from residents of apartment buildings, business entities providing services are given the opportunity to use the infrastructure available in the building free of charge. Operators are allowed to share telecommunications infrastructure facilities. In addition, the law provides a number of conveniences to entities operating in the telecommunications sector. According to the law, a license is no longer required to operate in telecommunications sector when providing services through applications of a bank, payment system, payment organization or e-commerce platform. At the 51st plenary session, senators discussed the law on making additions and amendments to certain legal documents of Uzbekistan. The law was approved by senators. At present, in order to turn the jewelry industry into one of the main drivers of the industry to support the development of jewelry production and trade, as well as to satisfy the needs of business entities for raw materials, an amendment which provides for the production of jewelry with the exemption from value at the tax of importing precious stones into the territory of the Republic of Uzbekistan is being introduced in the tax code of the Republic of Uzbekistan with this law. In order to further develop tourism, support children's health centers for their effective operation and create the necessary conditions for them, this law immense a tax code of the Republic of Uzbekistan on the basis of children's health centers in the trade union system. In addition, the law of Uzbekistan on tourism is being amended, which provides for the exemption from mandatory certification of holiday homes and recreation zones for children, which are organized outside the holiday season on the basis of children's health camps in the trade union system. 